Good morning. Yeah, things are a little different today, eh? What is this chicken doing here? Now I'm just wandering around to our Feed the Beast server. I'm gonna turn my jetpack off so I can actually take a real walk. Sometimes I like to wander around Minecraft. Of course, it's gonna be night soon, so I'm probably gonna have to fight my way through this video. But, you know, whatever. I was playing, and I was thinking about the distinction between characters and avatars. I mean, some games, I play a lot of games. I love, I love games. Play video games, tabletop games, board games, card games, you name it. And in some games, we look at our characters as avatars. In most games, probably. You know, your character, your, your person, my, in this case, my nano-armored Minecraft Steve, is, ooh, that's not loaded. They're just a piece of you that navigates around. Like, they're the, your extension in the game, in the world of the game. I am stuck. They, they're nothing more than that. They don't have any, any kind of distinctiveness on their own. They're, you just drive them around like a car. The things you do are the things that they do. And that makes perfect sense. In a lot of cases. I mean, if I'm playing Grand Theft Auto or something like that. But it, at the same time, we ha we're, we're kind of drawn to these games that have characters. Not just avatars, but characters. I mean, Mass Effect's a really good example of this. Where you you aren't just you, you're Colonel Shepard or Commander Shepard, Commander Shepard. And that means something. That mean that means something more than you know, you should just navigate through the game and shoot everybody and get to the end. You know, it means that you have your own goals, but Shepard should and does have his own goals. I mean, does that make sense? Am I talking at my ass here? Uh, I noticed it recently in in I do it in 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 Sky games like Skyrim and whatnot. I'm like, oh, you know, I'm the I'm the Dragonborn. I'm the hero. I probably wouldn't steal all these things on depending on the game. Some saves, I'm like, I'm the Dragonborn, I'm the hero. But you know what? I'm not that kind of hero. I'm going to take all your stuff. And you're going to like it. Why? Because I saved all of you. And that's what makes different playthroughs more interesting. Is that... Hello, sheep. Hello. Is that... This... Here's my portal thingy. Oh, it's open. Well, that's no good. It's hideous, I apologize. That's what makes replays interesting, is that you get to be different every time. And what makes games like Minecraft replays interesting is that you get to make different things every time. But they aren't, they aren't the same. They aren't equivalent. I mean, I could make all the things in one Minecraft game if I really wanted to, but... I can only progress through a game as one kind of shepherd, one kind of... Did you hear that? I thought I heard something. I should go home. All right. There we are. It's my house down there. I don't remember where I left my... Oh, there it is, my actual house. But I want to know, which do you prefer, characters or avatars, and why? I mean, I think it really depends on the kind of game more than anything. But I'm interested to hear, so uh, leave it in the comment. This is, of course, the Minecraft world where we're going to be doing our Minecraft adventures. Uh, later, Kaylee and Dan and I are going to wander around and explore far, far, far away from all our things. I don't know what happened to that tree. But... So consider this an introduction to our Minecraft world and some stuff I was thinking about. 
I will see you guys on Friday. Cause I'd love you even if we were being chased by a horde of zombies. I'd never leave you behind.